From March 5th to August 25th of 2013, the Doris Friedman Plaza on the southeastern end of Central Park was host to United Enemies. The works were created by Thomas Schutte, artist born in Oldenburg, Germany. The sculptures are two pairs of cast bronze male figures bound together with rope and balancing on a tripod of sticks. They stand 13 feet in height. They were conceived in the early 1990s when the artist was residing in Italy. The time he spent there was marked by political controversies. Heads of state and others were being exposed and arrested for corruption. The figures do not make reference to any particular person or organization. Upon close inspection, we see that the faces are highly abstracted. We can discern that the faces look aged and anguished. Enmity can validate an idea, but it can also be a sign of a psychological dysfunction. Swaddling robes conceal the bodies of the figures. Sharply detailed robes bind them together. The robe and robes represent the problem that is causing the enmity. Due to its negative relativist nature, enmity is an experience that drains the vitality of those involved. With the faces rendered in this abstracted and soft focus, we visualize how this reality is manifested in a potential host. This composition operates on many different levels. Their political overtones reference the enmity that is present within opposing political structures and other impersonal phenomena. We can also relate to them on a personal level. They can echo dysfunctional familial or secular relationships. It can also stand for battles within our own psychological makeup. Although enmity is an abstract concept, we have here in visual representation material that can help us see how this concept is reflected within our psyche. Thank you for your attention.